Hello class, how are you? Excellent. Okay, so we've seen the last week we were working on the head, yes? We were studying the parts of the head, the face, the brain, the skull, yes. And this week we want to focus on the trunk. The trunk is the part of the body where the head, the arms and the legs are connected. So this is the trunk with no head, no arms, no legs. This is the part of the body called trunk. It is, it is also called torso sometimes, yes? In the arts, it's called torso. Okay, on the exterior part of the trunk, we can find the chest, yes? Is here on the upper part of the trunk, yes? This is the front view, this is the side view, yes? And this is the back view. The chest is here, yeah, good. And uh, also, the belly or tummy, yes, your belly or your tummy, in front view and on the side view. The belly is around your waist, yes, the waist down. And also, we have the back, the back of your, of the trunk is called the back, yes. And yes, at the very bottom <laughs> of the back, we have of the bottom, or bad, or bad, yeah. You can choose <laughs> the bottom, bad, or bad. Good, excellent. So let's continue. In the interior part of the trunk, we can find some important muscles under the skin. Under the skin, we have the trapezius. Trapezius, that it has that shape. That's why it has that name. And this muscle helps you to move the arms and your back. Alrighty. Yeah, it's a big one, isn't it? Look, it's all these, yeah? All this part of the back forms the species. Pectorals. Pectorals are big muscles on top of your trunk. Uh, yes, and they form the chest. Yes, form the chest. Good. And then the abdominals are the middle part of your trunk look yes and it's also called the chocolate tablet yeah <laughs> the six pack the six pack and it is it is a bunch of muscles the abdominals there are a bunch of muscles sorry that help you you know turn your your trunk to one side to the other and bend down and up okay good Let's see these muscles in action. Look, this this trapezius is this part of the back, yes, and it holds, it help it, it helps holding your your head, yes, connects the head with the back, and also the arms with your back. Good, the abdominals. Yeah, oops, we have a video here. The abdominals. Look. They, these are the abdominals, remember? They help you to bend forward and backwards, yes. They help you to turn, yeah, to move around. And also, oops, to, uh, to move your belly up and down and inside out, yes. Good. And then the pectorals, remember? The big ones that are in <coughs> your chest, sorry, <coughs> are these big muscles here. Excellent. Under the muscles, we can find the bones of the trunk. Yeah? The spinal column, this is very important for you. This is the, you know, this line. You see the colors, the green, the yellow, the pink, and the blue, and the purple. All these are part of the spinal column bones connected these bones are called vertebrae sorry vertebrae yeah and the, 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 they have different shapes like these ones smaller bigger and bigger and they form all together connected like this the spinal column this is the back view this is the side view and this is the the view of the whole spinal column from all the angles yes so here in this picture, you can see that the spinal column helps you to bend in different directions, forward, 
backward, yes, to the left, to the right, and turn, rotate your your torso, yeah, without moving the legs. You can look to the yes, to the right, to the left, yeah, good. You have to take care of your spinal column. Take good care of the spinal column. Sitting down properly on a chair. And the muscles we can find also the bones of the rib cage. The rib cage is like a box in which we keep safe <laughs> the soft organs like the heart, the liver, and the lungs. the The rib cage it looks like an armor, yes, and it's made of twenty four ribs. Yeah, we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10, 11 here, 12 here, sorry, and 12 here, 11 and 12, and here another 12, 12 and 12, 24, yeah, the, the bone in the middle, the big and hard bone in the middle of your chest, yeah, touch it, touch it, yeah, you can feel it, connects the ribs to the chest, yeah, all the ribs are connected here in the middle with the sternum, is called sternum. Yes. Okay. Then under the bones we have some organs. Very important organs like the heart. Look at the heart. Look at the movements of the heart. Yes, the heart is a very strong muscle and it moves the blood around the body. Yes. It takes the blood around the body with the uh, with the ve veins and the arterias. And then we have the liver. The liver is this big, big, big brown organ under the lungs. And the liver works like a factory. Yeah, it's always creating, fabricating, yes, substances that we need to leave in order to live, yes. And also helps cleaning the blood. Yeah, when the blood is not so clean, the liver works very hard. Then we have the lungs, these pink big parts, big organs, yeah, around the the heart are the lungs. Yes, when we breathe in and we breathe out, the lung takes the oxy oxygen, breathing in, and then expels the bad, uh, the part, part of the air, the carbon dioxide, okay, the not so good air. We keep the good air, the oxygen, and we <laughs> expel the thing that the air that we don't need, that is no good for us. Okay, excellent. Let's see how the lungs work a little bit if we are lucky. Okay, this is a view uh, of the lungs. Yes. They are big, big one. They are big organs, sorry. Yes. Inside the rib cage. Excellent. Let's continue. Okay, so under the skin, under the muscles, and under the bones, we find more organs like the stomach. This big orange part in the picture. Well, it's not as big as the liver. Look at the liver. The liver is very big. The sm stomach is smaller, but it has a very important job too. It takes the food, yum yum yum, boom, and breaks, yum, chang chang chang, the food into little pieces with liquids, acids, acids, yes. So the food can go through the intestines. I, these intestines also take the food and distribute the food all around the body so oof, we have energy thank you to all these organs there, there are two types of intestines the large one yeah the big one yeah and the small one the small one is very long so together the large and the small they are like six meters long six meters long yeah a lot of a lot of interesting for us, yes, because they need to, you know, use all the activity in there 
to get the food and distribute it to the rest of the body. And the food that you know we don't use because it's not good for us goes through the large intestine to the rectum, the rectum, and then we go to the toilet and we do poo and bye bye. <laughs> Okay, let's continue with some other organs. The kidneys, these are the kidneys. The kidneys clean the, blo the blood and produce the urine, the pee, yes. Look, can you see the kidneys have these, you know, tubes connected to the bladder. So the kidneys clean the blood and the, bar the bad part of the, you know, the, the blood and the the food that we the drinks that we you know ingest they go ooh, through the tubes to the bladder bye bye we don't like you mm -hmm. it is not good for me so they clean and the rubbish goes boom down down to the bladder yeah the bladder is a muscular sac like this yeah that stores the urine the pee the, this yellow part is the urine yeah, and when we oh, when we want to go to the toilet, oh, uh, uh, I cannot hold it, teacher. I have to go to the bathroom. Yes, it's because the bladder is telling us that it's full. It's very, you know, you know, full. I have to go. I have to go. And then you go to the toilet and you do your pee. Okay, so this is it for today. We've seen lots of organs. Remember the bladder, the kidneys, the intestines, the stomach, the lungs, the liver, the heart. Yeah, and then the the bones, the rib cage, the spinal column, and the big muscles, the pectorals, trapezius, abdominals, and parts of your trunk, the exterior parts of parts of the trunk, the chest, the belly or tummy, the back, or the bottom, the bottom, sorry, the butt or the bum, and I'll forgot, but the waist also is here. Yes, remember the waist. Good. Okay, so see you soon. Bye bye.